Hello everybody, I am Tabash Modi and in this video here I will teach you how to make this Oregon Millennium Falcon by Shu Sugamata. So let's start. Okay, so to make this origami you're going to choose one square sheet of paper, like this one. And first of all we are going to start making a bird base, a to-do base, and it's something like this. Just fold here the paper in half. Then fold here in half again. Okay, now take here this flap, this first flap and open here this pocket okay. like this making this point here go up to this point here like this now turn the model over and do the same thing here in this pocket just open here Okay, now hold here the paper like this, okay, with the white side pointed down, and do something like this. You have to fold here the side of the paper, the side up to the middle line, like this. Do the same thing here. Now you're going to fold here along this line here. Okay. You have this line and this line, right? Now just fold this line here. Like this and unfold. Now pull here one layer, just one layer, fold this layer up like this, and at the same time you're going to open here to make a valley fold along this inner layer here. Okay, like this. Do the same thing here. And then fold here along this line, making this flap go down like this. And do the same thing here to this side. So fold here, <coughs> and here. Fold both of them, fold here up, just one layer up like this, and fold everything down like this. Okay, this is the true base or the bird base, so it's good for you to memorize this. Because in lots of origamis we just start doing this to the to base. So let's continue. Okay, so now we are going to fold here along this line here. Okay, making 
this side of the paper go up to the middle line like this okay and then unfold and do the same thing here to this side here and unfold okay now you just have to fold here this flap up like this making this okay this side here go up to this line here just a little bit stronger you have this line and this line right we're going to fold here up making this line here go up to this point and this point here so that's like this okay okay so you're going to do the same thing here to the other side so again fold like this this and fold everything for this this layer up like this okay now you're going to open this layer like this and this layer here just make the model look like this okay And we are going to do something like this now. Okay, hold like this and let's do this side here first. You have to fold here this layer, just uh, this flap here down. Okay, you have this line here, right? You're going to fold along this line here. something like this you have to fold down making this line get the line with this one here okay and fold here squash the paper just up to this line here okay then you have to make a very fold along this line belly fold right and at the same time you're going to fold fold this flap here back like this okay so now you're going to pull here this this flap up but not but not everything, just this much here is okay. Okay, let me show you inside. It's going to look like this. Right. So, do the same thing here. Let me show you again. You just open here, this flap. Fold this point down making this line, these two lines get aligned like this make a belly fold on the middle line and squash the paper now pull here this layer back up making look like this okay that's it inside is going to look like this okay just make a belly fold along this line here 
me zoom in a little bit more okay this line here okay so just fold here like this right and unfold now pull here these two sides a little bit just to to make it easier to make this this part now because it's going to be a little bit hard and it's like this you just have to okay you made a fold like this now make another fold along this line here okay and unfold everything okay this part here is a little bit hard you're going to pull here this this point here and this point here you're going to pull down making a valley fold along this line at the same time so it's just like this you have to pull here okay and then you press the middle making a square in the middle so you have to practice this kind of fold it's really not easy to make if you practice it's not going to be hard to make anyway but I know the first time you make this kind of fold you're going to mess up a little bit and well now fold here this just this tip here you're going to fold back like this just to hide that little tip and make they're gonna get a little more round shape okay do the same thing here to the other side and that's it it's going to look like this okay now you're going to fold here this flap here up like this then you're going to fold here making a 45 degrees here so it's something like this you just have to fold making this line here get horizontally and making 90 degrees with this middle line here okay just like this now do the same thing here this side but at the same time you're going to make a valley fold along this line here let me show you it's like this okay 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 now make another valley fold along this middle line here and it's going to have a flap here up like this okay not just open here the middle of this flap and it's going to look like this now we are going to make this square here the same way in this part here but before you just have to do something like this you just have to fold here okay fold here aligning this this fold here with this line here As the model is not perfectly folded so it's a little bit hard to, to get the references but something like this 
Okay. And then you just fold here along this line. Now this middle line. And then you just fold back one more time. Make a crimp fold here. Okay. Just like this. And do the same thing here to this side. Okay, that's it. Okay, now that we already folded here the references, you're going to unfold here both sides. Then turn here this flap to the left. Then reverse all the folds we made, we just made like this. Okay. okay, and fold the flap back. And do the same thing here, to the left side. Okay, like this. Now you're going to make here in this top part, you're going to do the same thing we made in this part here. You're going to make this square. So just to make it, let's do something like this. Fold here, get this flap down, okay? And fold here, like this. As you can see, it's like this. And then you're going to make another fold along this line. Okay, and do the same thing. So let me. This side here it's a little bit harder because the layers are a little bit more thick. Okay, I couldn't do it perfectly but it's something like this. Okay, and you're going to fold here, this tip here, you're going to make a valley fold, like this, okay? In this side here we made a mountain fold, but in this side we're going to make a valley fold, okay? Now just make here a belly fold along this line here, okay? And turn the model over like this. Zoom out a little bit. Okay. And make here a fold along this line here, okay? making the side of the paper go up to the middle line. model again and fold here this flap all the way up like this 
and fold a small amount here. Make a, a belly fold along this line here. There's no reference, so just by looking, try to fold something like this. Okay. Now you're going to fold here, side up to this point here. You're going to make this line here. Okay, let me just do it. You're going to make this line here have a 90 degrees with this line here. So this line must stand horizontally. Okay. Something like this. And oh okay and starting from at this point here so just like this do the same thing here so like this okay now you're going to fold here along this line you're going to make a valley fold okay oh this line here this line as you can see it, it it's parallel with this line here and this is the reference to start making this this fold here so let me just show you it's something like this you have to fold here make a valley fold along this line, like this okay and then you just squish the paper here this side okay and you're going to make a mountain fold on this line here now now you're just going to fold here this small chip here behind like this okay okay that's it and do the same thing here to this side so okay you're going to fold here So it's going to look like this. Okay. Okay, now you're going to make a belly fold along this line here. Okay, you don't you don't have any reference but it's something like this. A, a mountain fold, I said a belly fold, but it's a mountain fold along this line like this. Again, there's no reference, but try to look and make the same shape. So it, it would be something like this. Then you're going to fold here this flat, make a belly fold along this line here. Okay. Belly fold. And at the same time, you're going to press here the middle to make this middle part here get symmetrical like this okay like this right now you're going to make here let me zoom in a little bit more You're going to make here a fold like this. Okay, my 
thing is not working. But well, it's it's like this. You just have to make a fold here and another fold really close to the first one around here. So it's just to make the shape, so it's something like this. Okay. Okay. I think it's okay like this. Okay, now we have here this line here, right? We are going to make a fold. Is it? We are going to make a fold along with um, 50 to 60 degrees from this one here. I think it's something like this. Okay. And do the same thing here now to this direction. Okay. Now you're going to fold both sides, this line here and this line at the same time, and fold this middle flap here in the middle in half like this. Then just turn this flap to the right side, and now you're going to make a valley fold along this line here. The valley fold here, okay. and you're going to make this flap here and this one here. Just pull those these two flaps to make it get in front of this one, of this one here, like this. And now this flap here, you're going to do something like this. Just open here the bottom side, okay? Fold here down like this, right? Now fold up like this. I'm just making reverse folds, okay? So, again. Okay. Made a reverse fold here, another reverse fold up, and I'm going to make one more reverse fold down like this, and just hide here this small flap here to inside like this, and make this thing here get the round shape. Just like this. Okay, so again, hide, hide it. Now, turn the model to the other side. Here you're going to do something like this. Just pull here. You have this flap. You're going to pull, pull it until this line get parallel with this line here. Can you see it? Right? So the same thing here. Just pull until this line get parallel with this line. Okay. Now just fold here. Strip to inside. 
to make the whole origami get a round shape right and also here I'm going to fold to inside and here Okay, now the last, the last detail here is in this part, you're going to open here a little bit, okay, and fold up like this. It's a little bit hard. Let, let me just zoom in here. Okay, so you have this layer here, okay? You have to press it a little bit here, okay? Then you're going to fold the top part to inside. this okay, and fold small part here a small chip here and here <laughs> it's so small that it's hard to explain I well I hope you could understand but it's something like this you just I'm just making it get a round shape. Okay? It's going to look like this. And that's it. You're gonna miss finish it. Um no. <laughs> you have to fold your the top part. Change it like this. Just make a reverse fold, okay? Open here the side and fold to inside like this. And that's it, the origami is done. Okay, this is the origami. Um, I think you may... Well, if you use a better paper, uh, you know, Kami paper is not good to make this kind of origami. So, a chisel foil, I think it's it would be a good paper because you can shape it uh, the way you you want it to be and that's it i hope you enjoyed the video thanks for this video see you bye bye